Hello. So the seventh mail storm doll is here. It has been announced for CN. Uh, Bella Vita, I believe her name is. She's the second Mercury healer to be in the game. The first one was um, Aradisia, which was released with Isle Adventure event. Uh, in that event, a sea elf was mentioned. And now we have a character that is a sea elf. So yeah, I was kind of pleased by her reveal. So yeah, I kind of was super excited to see her. But well, let me just get this nitpick out of the way because come on now, they need to put that sprite base to rest. Um, okay. <laughs> All jacks aside, let's get to her skills. Her first skill is restores the health of all allies, increases the maximum life of all allies by a certain percentage of a certain period of time, and reduces the damage received by all allies. Healing and damage reduction, no effect added to this one. Mm. Okay. Her second skill is charged one. Uh, what it does is it clears all allied debuff, restores life to all allies, and increases the magic damage dealt by all allies for a certain period of time. This skill is good. I think the second skill is good. Um, and it has a buff, damage buff to it, but this is exactly why I was reluctant about pulling for Princess Aminami because it's a charged skill. I feel like if the charged skill um, does extra damage or does extra healing, then that's fine. But um, buffing or improving the skill after 10 seconds or ho however long it takes for the charged skill to be released, yeah, I don't think uh, it's ideal. Then we have her passive skill. When the HP of allies is lower than 50%, uh, it will auto automatically release the sea and sky skill once, and it will only take effect once within a certain period of time. Sounds good for like a boss, right? A boss battle, so maybe for survival, not so much for speedrunning. Okay, now on to her weapon. To be honest, I'm not sure about the skill description for this weapon. I know it improves one of the skills, but I'm not sure which skill. But at least we know what it does. Sorry. And yeah, that's pretty much the base 6 about her. Uh, yeah, she's not exactly a must doll. But I think she's better or more appealing than Cortana. I think when she arrives to global, which is, I don't know, two months from now. Maybe more, I don't know. Uh, yeah, I think I might consider getting her unless there is a better doll than her. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, what do you think? Uh, would you be interested in her? I mean, uh, I knew I know people were excited about a new Mercury healer when was when Aradisia was first released, but she ended up being a sack doll, I believe. <laughs> I don't see people actively use her. But yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching.